friends, if you're interested in the specially selected lobster mac and cheese from all these, then you're going to want to keep watching. Hello everyone. Before I dive into this taste test from Aldi, I want to start by saying how much I adore Aldi as a grocery store. It's one of my favorite places to shop and I genuinely appreciate the quality and value they offer. Now as we explore different foods, it's important to remember that personal taste can vary widely. Just because I might not enjoy a particular product as much as others doesn't reflect negatively on Aldi in any way. Every store, including Aldi, has a vast selection of items, and not every product will appeal to every individual. So if you see me not entirely loving a specific item during this taste test, please know that it's just my personal taste, and I have the utmost respect for Aldi. Let's embark on this taste testing adventure together and celebrate the delicious variety that Aldi has to offer. But remember, your own taste buds might have a different take. And that's perfectly okay. Enjoy the video and let's savor these flavors with an open mind. Hey friends, it's Kelly and welcome back to Mama Needs a Gold. Thank you so much for joining me today. And if you're new here, welcome, welcome. So friends, you guys, um, it answered my question about whether or not you wanted me to do any Aldi taste tests. And I had quite a few people that said yes. So I decided I'll be doing some Aldi taste tests. My son loves crab mac and cheese or lobster mac and cheese, and I saw this one there. It's the specially selected lobster and mac and cheese. Now, I have heard people did not like this on the Aldi Facebook page that I follow, so I'm a little skeptical, <laughs> but the true test is going to be my son. So we're just having hot dogs, or not hot dogs, hamburgers today. Um, real quick and I thought I would throw this in and my son and I will try it and I will let you know what we think. So my oven is um, set for 400 so that is preheating now and I'm gonna turn the camera down, open this up and show you what it looks like. Alrighty, here we go. Let's open this up. says just to remove the plastic. We do. Doesn't look like a lot in here, that's for sure. It's pretty heavy. I felt for sure there's gonna be a lot more in there. And I, it says to put it on a tray, put it in the center rack. How many ounces is this? 18 ounces, one pound, two ounces. That does not look like a pound. I don't know, we'll see friends. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the oven. All right, my friends, so I have to cook it for 40 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead, set the timer for about 30 minutes and then that way hubby can go ahead and get the hamburger started. I have some uh, Amish macaroni salad and potato salad um, still left in the fridge from dinner the other day. So we're just kind of gonna eat that as well. So if this is a total fail, at least we <laughs> have that as a backup. So um, I'll come back when we take it out. <clears throat> All right, my friends, let's check. Oh, it doesn't smell bad. I'm shocked. Let me turn the camera down so you can look. It looks good. I can be honest with you, it doesn't smell bad at all. All right, so there it is, friends. All right, my friends, so there it is. I'm gonna let it cool for about two minutes and then we'll do a taste test. All right, my friends, so here it is. My son has some over there. He doesn't wanna be on camera. Let's give it a quick taste test, see what we think. It does smell pretty good. Mm. What do you think? Don't like it? He doesn't like it. No, no, he doesn't like it at all. Whoop, I just blew up. He's shaking his head no. It's very creamy. I wouldn't say it's horrible. If I had it on my plate and I had to eat it, I would eat it. Would I buy it again? No. It has. 
I know it's seafood, <clears throat> but it has more of a fishy taste to it. Um, I don't think it's as bad as what people were saying when I was seeing it on Facebook. Um, I definitely could eat it. He's shaking his head no, saying absolutely not. <laughs> um, I would, if I had to rate this one to five, I'd, I'd probably give it a one, one and a half. Um, it's not my favorite. It's okay, but it does have like a fishy taste. It is very creamy. Um, I'm not tasting the cheese. The seafood takes over. I'm not enjoying the cheese at all. I'm just not getting the cheese flavor. So I think the seafood, the lobster, is too overpowering for this. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna say fail. Um, this was not one of ones that I care for or will buy again. I also will put the price of what I paid for that on the screen as well, just so you know. So friends, <clears throat> that'll do it for today's taste test. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it was helpful in case you've been thinking about getting it. Now you know what I think about it and what my son thinks about it. So if you haven't already subscribed, please go ahead and hit that little subscribe button as it does greatly help me out. And also please check me out over on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, and TikTok as I am active on all those social media sites as well. So friends, thanks so much. And I will catch up with you at our next taste test. Bye.